I want to say that Prophet Timmy Joshua is a teacher, a mentor, and a father. He invested in changing people's lives. I am one out of millions who benefited from this. So I want to talk about the reaction of John C, one of the former disciples of TB Joshua. He was one of the wise men before he left Squad. This video was posted 23 hours ago on his official YouTube channel. I want to point out some things about this video. This is actually, I take it as his official reaction to the BBC documentary that was done about his mentor, late Prophet T.B. Joshua. So let's listen to me. Uh, I will point out some things after now. Let's continue. Chris, when I first met Prophet T.B. Joshua in 1999, he did not hesitate to adopt me as one of his children. He caused me to forget my unworthy background. Prophet T.B. Joshua impacted my life and changed me. He picked me from a male builder to a prayer warrior to an evangelist. He sent me to preach to many branches in Nigeria and outside Nigeria. He later elevated me to the position of wise man, which means greater responsibility. Even when I became an apostle of God, he never stopped playing his role as a teacher and mentor. Throughout the years I lived with Prophet T.B. Joshua, he taught us the law of God and how to have an extraordinary relationship with God. He taught us to be kind, to love, to forgive, and to be humble. I have learned so much from Prophet T.B. Joshua. A few days before he went to be with the Lord, he called me and my wife and encouraged us to stand firm and to remain steadfast in the faith, as we have been doing. The memories last forever. Prophet Tony Joshua, that you have been called home for eternal rest with God may seem impossible to the human eye because of the numerous act of love you pursued act that have impacted the lives of millions of people around the world with my humble self as a typical case in point so i want to thank god for his life well spent prophet T. joshua's legacy lives on prophet T. joshua's legacy lives on and I want to say that he remained my mentor even in death. I will follow in his footsteps. Thank you very much for your time, sir. May God bless his family Amen. and the ministry. Amen. 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 Thank you, sir. Okay, so this is um, his former wise man before he left to to his own ministry. John Chi, this is his official reaction. Uh, if you look at everything he said, he did not mention anything about the BBC documentary. Please take note. He actually made his own reaction carefully, tactfully. He did not say anything about the BBC documentary. He did not say anything about the accusation. He did not refute any of the accusations that all these people are lying or they are saying the truth. There was nothing like that. 
All he said is what Ebi Joshua had done for him, the impact he has made in his life, and the impact he has made in the lives of other people. He identified himself with the ministry of T.B. Joshua, and he even says that even to death, T.B. Joshua remains his mentor. Why am I doing this video? A lot of people are reacting. Some have come up openly to say, we know T.B. Joshua, he never did these things. Some are saying, oh, we knew all this why that he was a false prophet. Some others are attacking these people that have come out to say, this is what we suffered in the hands of late prophet B. Joshua. Some others are attacking BBC. They are saying, oh, this is a British cooperation. So what are you doing in Africa? What are you doing here? Uh, the white people have enslaved us and now they are coming to divide the blacks against the blacks. This is a man that worked with T.B. Joshua. He lived in the synagogue. He refused to say anything about the documentary. Please take note of this. And I know everybody that has passed through the mentorship of T.B. Joshua is definitely going to react. Because if people are saying things against your mentor, somebody, everybody knows that, okay, this is a one that, this is a person that made you who you are. I know it is God that called people. Uh, God calls people into different um, ministries. But if the, your mentor is 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 receiving these high levels of allegations and for investigative journalists to come up with this level of revelations about your mentor, if you come out to say, oh, he is false, it means your ministry is questionable. People are going to begin to point fingers. Especially if you run the same type of ministry, if you if you identify with him even till his death and you run your ministry as a carbon copy of his ministry, people are going to start pointing, pointing fingers. We as Christians, it is good, we dig deep in prayers, using the spirit of discernment to begin to look into these allegations. Meanwhile, these allegations have been, uh, Bissola Johnson has written some books because I'm, I'm hearing some people saying, oh, why did you not say these things when he was alive? Oh, there were documents. In fact, one of the ladies actually brought out a footage of how she went to squad the synagogue to confront uh, late prophet T.B. Joshua when he was alive. When we see allegations like these, we should also investigate to know the truth. And we as Christians, we should be wise. That is the truth. The Bible has already told us. The Bible tells us of how the end time is going to look like. Unfortunately, a lot of us are blind. We are looking for miracles. We are looking for people we can use to replace God. And that is why even when we see the truth very open, we still try to fight and defend even the things that are wrong. Let us be wise. Let us know that this is the end time. Look at someone who was what? Under T.B. Joshua, T.B. Joshua made him who he is today. Look at his response. Look at his reaction. Some of you who have never lived in synagogue, you are insulting and saying different things. He just says, this is what I know him to be. This is what he has done in my life. And he has 
affected a lot of lives. And that's everything he says. What's your opinion? Drop your opinion in the comment section. Thank you. God bless you. Bye. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel. Eagle Ayopuna Global Attrition.